James told Zora to make his own show, but all of his ideas were a tragic mess. He was staring on the barrel of a huge crossbow, and a little shit appeared with a magic chest. DVDs of horror classics with a special audio track, the slasher super secret thoughts, much to Zora and shock. They talk! Hello? Uh, Hi, would you want to help me in a bar trivia contest? Who is this? The name's Ghostface. So, want to win some bar bucks? <laughs> I don't think so. I'll give it a shot. Like, name the 1991 D. Wallace slasher. Popcorn. Yeah! Wait, is this Drew Barrymore? Uh-huh. Oh, I'm a big fan. What have you been up to? Well, I'm getting ready to watch a video. Oh, I meant career-wise, but what video? Oh, just some scary movie. Oh, the ones with the Wayans brothers? Uh-huh. Oh, I love those movies. Man, I really pity anyone who tries to do a screen parody after they've already done theirs. Those movies are the best. Well, well the first one was, but the rest sucked. Uh, those that were in Beverly Hills Chihuahua shouldn't throw stones. <laughs> hey, uh, ZX, got your jump scare delivery. I'm calling the police. Well, after you're done screaming, I'm just gonna need a signature. Why are you doing this? I wanna play a game. And I want you to remember that I came up with that before Jigsaw. Well, what kind of a game? Oh, I'm not picky. We could do Seven Wonders, Salem, Boss Monster, Camp Grizzly. Oh, Settlers of Catan. Can you say Settlers of Catan? Yeah, let's play Settlers. Yeah, sure, if you want to be a basic bitch. Make sure to stay tuned after Awkward for the premiere of MTV's Scream the TV Show. Okay, back to bar trivia. What actor played the love guru? Michael. Michael. <laughs> yes, that's right. Actually, did you hear? They're in production on Love Guru 2. No! Oh, okay, not a Love Guru fan. Let's just get back to the questions. Which London brother was in Mall Rats? Jason! 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 Oh, I'm so sorry. It was actually Jeremy. Jeremy London. No, it's not! No, it's not! It was Jason! Uh, I'm looking at IMDB right now, and it was Jeremy. Listen, it was Jason! I saw that movie 20 goddamn times! Okay, that is far too many times to have been watching Mall Rats, but let me tell you right now, Jason London and Jeremy London are twin brothers. So, there you go. You Okay, that's fair. Just like I tricked the editor into letting me attack you with a jump card. Danger! And there's your lesson in Unagi. Also, did you notice there's no glass even though you heard a glass shattering sound? It's got nudity, am I right? Anyway, one final trivia question for you. Where should I put this knife? There we go, right answer. Now, just so you know, this isn't personal. I was hired by Rotten Tomatoes to take out actors whose Rotten score outweighs their fresh rating. And thanks to Freddy Got Fingered and those later Adam Sandler movies, you have got to go. Now, I respect Adam as a person, but those later films feel a lot like a... Oh, yeah, like that. Oh, God. All right, Josie Grossy, we've got to finish this, because I am late for karaoke tonight. I hope you're ready for a blood shower, and I don't mean the one from your movie Doppelganger. Yeah! Uh, guess you can't say you've never been kissed by death. <laughs> oh, I hated the movie Blended. Hi, who is this? Oh, uh, yes, I'm with the uh, electric company, and I was wondering, uh, is your refrigerator running? Well, I, I have no idea. Oh, uh, 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 never mind, okay, bye. You blew it! So I have to ask, do you like the kill count? Oh, come on, you know I don't watch that shit. Why, don't you like comedic recaps of horror movies? No. No, it's just, what's the point? They're all the same. Some stupid killer stalking some big-breasted girl who can't act who's always running up the stairs when she should be going out the front door. It's insulting. Well, how about our new show, They Talk? It's got more meta-references than a Deadpool speech. It's so unoriginal. I'm disappointed in you. Damn it, Soren. I told you it was a hard sell. I'll teach you to bad mouth YouTube shows, Dev. Elbow! Oh, wait. This is stunt double. Um, I don't kill stunt doubles. Editor, can we please bring back Dev? Thank you. Now we can get on with this. All right. It's my job to kill anyone whose IMDb has been flooded by bad movies. And yours is full of them. 54, Drowning Mona, Lion King 2, Simba's Pride. I mean, that did not need a sequel. But now for your circle of nine. Oh, okay. Uh, yes, you're right. Lion King 2 wasn't all that bad. I actually did like some of the songs there, like uh, in New Pendy. <laughs> hey, what are you doing running up the stairs? You just said that was a stupid thing to do in a horror movie. That's as hypocritical as you do your screen four after Bad Mouth and Sequel. Can you look at this place? It's like Christmas. Hey, we got another Sandler alone. Sorry, gotta kill you for Little Nicky, Sandy Wexler, and Click. Nothing personal, they're all critically right. Just doing my job. Even though Click was hilarious in its own way. I mean, Kate Beckinsale married to Adam Sandler. Yeah, that's funny. Love Jim Barry, though. Storch. 
Shut up, door, door, shut up, shut up, door, shut up, door, shut up. Oh, wait, did I just lock myself out of this guild? Okay, well, this is just embarrassing. I need to get in there and kill her. Oh, come on, come on. Uh, well, at least I can set the mood in there. Alexa, grab my dog. Hey, shitheads. Okay, that's fair. I did lock the door. You know what? I'm going to go find the key. Uh... Hey, does anyone know where the keys are? I'm supposed to be killing Rose McGowan. But she's not in any of the movies. Yeah, that's not really my MO. I just kill people in bad movies, and unfortunately, he's made a shit ton of them. Oh, you want to play Psycho Killer? Oh, yeah, I love talking heads. <laughs> Casper, that's rap. Oh, but I didn't even get to the Tesca say part yet. You know what, Rose? Andy, You're not going to appreciate you fresh lyrics in a Purple Pop's punk song. I think it's time for you to say goodbye to your semi charmed kind of life and join the Doom Generation, which is just one of your many bad movies, like Monkey Bone, Ready to Rumble, and Jawbreaker. Yarr! Oh, speaking of Jawbreakers. Oh, hey, is your butt like one of those magic eyes where if I stare at it long enough, I'll see a dolphin or a dinosaur or a... Oh, <laughs> gave me in the dick, phone! Oh, what are these made of, sugar glass? Wait, is that banana peel? What? Oh, God! Oh, my back! Oh, 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 hey, where are you going? Oh, that's your plan to go through that door? Your boobs are never gonna make it out. Oh, they did there. Oh, see, they did there. Okay, interesting. See, now your boobs are out. What is stopping you from escaping? Ah, it doesn't matter. Let's try this. There's no way. Is this actually working? Oh my god, this is the greatest garage door ever. Was this created by Tim the Tool Man Taylor? More power! Oh, 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 man. Guess she's not death proof. Hey, I do see a dolphin. And a schooner. Hey, am I up next for karaoke? Almost! Oh, it's time to do it all for the nookie. What do I have to do to prove to you that I'm not a killer? Oh, hey, is that Johnny Depp? Oh, I'm a big fan. God. You know, you're not on my list, but huh? you were in Jack and Jill, so watch your ass. Oh, oh you're Skeet Ulrich. Sydney. People don't even know your bad movies like Touch and Armored and also Chill Factor. And don't forget Austin Found, even though we as a society definitely did. Now back to you, Nev. I rechecked your fresh rating, and you are split right down the middle. 12 good, 12 bad. For every wild things, you've got a three to tango. And I don't even know which of those is bad. Personally, I love three to tango. You and Maddie Perry have great chemistry. But this is my job, and I don't want to lose my 401k! Help me! Hey, careful there! I don't want you to fall on my house insurance just lapsed, and I want to make sure that my premium doesn't go up. No, my premium! Did you land on a mattress boat? That's not even a thing! Watch out, Jamie. You know he's around. You, you know? Oh. Oh, Jamie Kennedy, oh. I have been looking for you for a long time. All the crap you've been in. Malibu's Most Wanted, Son of the Mask, Dr. Doolittle 2, Farce of the Penguins, Larry the Cable Guy's Christmas Spectacular. Oh, and of course, the Jamie Kennedy Experiment, which wasn't a movie, but God, you're so self-involved. You don't even notice me back here. You're too busy calling out your own name. Jamie, turn around. Yeah, turn around. It's time for your distraction. I'll get back to you, but first... Ah, gotcha, Kevin Smith. This is for yoga hosers and tusks. Wait, no, you're just hardworking character actor W. Earl Brown. Oh man, you were in Deadwood. Damn it. Hey, uh, Nev, please don't tell my manager about this, okay? Yep, this airhead is dead. And if I've learned anything from a murder mystery party, it's that one stab to the back is something you can never come back from. Also, did you know he was in Ready to Rumble with Rose McGowan? It's like six degrees of Kevin Bacon, but, you know, with murder. Now, as for you, Ned, maybe we can work something out. Oh, come on! We could go to Denny's, buy a couple of moons over my hammy. You could even invite some friends. I'll make the reservation. What do you say, party of five? Okay, the door lock thing's getting a little childish now, and, uh... Oh, what's that? Is this something? Hey there, crafty girl. Hey, gonna act like a baby? I'm gonna jingle some keys in front of you. Oh, so shiny and exciting. <laughs> Grandma! Hello, help me please. I'm at Stu Mucker's house on Turner Lane. It's 261. Uh, right? Turner Lane, please. He's oh, gonna try and well, kill me. Come on, whatever. I'm in overtime anyway, and they are not gonna authorize time and a half. I'm only trying this one more time. Oh, 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 stop it! Enough with the kicks, Liu Kang! You know what, Nev? Go on, live. It doesn't matter to me anymore. And I am out of this movie about horror cliches by using one of the most trite ones possible. I'm gonna run away, and it looks like I was never even there. All magical just don't look down the road. Bye. Welcome to the Kill Count. I'm James H. Denise, and today we're looking at Mortal Kombat. That's not a horror movie. It's his channel. He can do what he wants. Man, I can't believe he came back like a second season of Jericho. Nuts to that. <laughs> See, it's funny because the fans send a bunch of nuts to CBS to bring the show back. 
It's always better when you explain the jokes. Anyway, with your jughead out of the way, there's only one last thing to do. Look in front of you, Jamie. That's for ruining the Tremors franchise, you jackass! Hey, Ghostface, you're up next for karaoke! Ah, duty call. I did it all for you, Sydney! What? For Sydney! What? So you can take this franchise and stick it up your yeah! Stick it up your yeah! Stick it up your yeah! Stick it up your what? Alright, everybody give it up for Ghostface. Up next, we've got Jigsaws again, Fred Like Me. You did good, kid. You did real good. Thanks, man. Yeah, you, you said words like I would say them. Very fast and a lot of them. Yeah. Thank you again for watching. I've hidden some more Easter eggs in there. One graboid, one critter. As a way of telling James that maybe he should do those one day on the kill count. Maybe? Yeah. I should just email. That's the only way you're going to get a request through. Should we say what the next one is? Yeah, that's good business. The next one is... Predator! Predator. Ah! This is a Tuscan Raider. Man. Yeah, I don't know. Predator. This is going to be a terrible episode. Thanks for watching. <laughs> <laughs>